So to put today into perspective, okay, this parade celebrated DC's first title in the major four professional sports since the Redskins back in 1992. But the day was about a lot more than just sports, as you can feel if you were out there or covering any part of this along the journey. Mm. Here's Scott Broom with a look at the impact on all of us. Well, it's all over now. Hey, how'd you like that? Hey, it was great. Let's go cast. <laughs> all right. When's the last time you walked down Constitution Avenue like this? I've never done it. Oh, First no. time. Well, out in the middle of the street. This was really fun. Yeah. Who's come? And you know what strikes me about it? This whole event was an equalizer for our city. No matter where you're from, this is the best part about living in Washington, D.C. So you got all sorts of folks here, and um, there are no closet Caps fans. Everybody comes out, and we're all one big part of the family. Everybody wants to talk about how divisive we are. It's not. Look at how excited everybody is. Today, we're all together, and we're all rooting for the same team, so it's awesome. <laughs> So this, this is big. This is like unity bringing the city together. We love the food. Love the food. We love the food in D.C. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. You've been here 35 years. Yeah. What did this do for the city today? What was it like? Don't you see the crowds? Don't you see everybody so jubilant? It's fun. It should be, right? We're all from D.C. It is fun. It is. I'm from Baltimore. This is great. Well, what do you think of D.C. people now? Ah, uh, you guys are okay. <laughs> Yeah. This many people in, in, the, in the nation's capital and so peaceful. I mean, it's all just having fun. Not a protest, a celebration. That's it. That's it. Celebrations. So, the moral of the story is the Caps did a lot more for Washington than just win a Stanley Cup. On Constitution Avenue, Scott Broom, WUSA 9.